Afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode here on Pasty Shifts Game. We're doing another hype train. We're checking out other games and other stuff that's actually available or being recently released onto uh, YouTube channels, uh, hey, trailers, game releases. This one we're actually doing is Naruto to Bruto Shinobi Striker. Another Naruto game, surely. I, I'm, I've never been a massive Naruto fan. I've been a fan of the series because of uh, my college years, I played through most of the original Naruto series. Shippuden passed me by for a long while, but then I went and did a whole binge to work my way back up to catch up to where the series is now, where uh, Boruto started. And I kind of enjoyed some parts of it, not brilliant all the way through. There was a lot of filler in there, and uh, Shippuden just didn't hold my attention as the original show did because I don't have the time to watch it. I didn't kind of like invest myself in the commitment of like burning through seasons to make sure I was up to date with it. So um, yeah, Naruto 2 Boruto, Shinobi Striker. Let's take a look to see what it's got. So, of course, they're doing Naruto 2 Boruto. That's actually the main thing. It's actually um, setting themselves up for the new series. Ah, the Shinobi War was the worst part of Shippuden. <laughs> Did feel like it dragged for too long. Here goes! Nope. Let's do this. That's cool. Um, one of my favorite parts was actually kind of the more open range Naruto games rather than actually the fighters. Here it comes. I'll do it. Get lost. So is it open world in the combat only, or like as a large arena? Because it weirdly reminds me a lot of the Gundam game I've been playing as free to play. Dance. I'll finish you off. All right. I'm gonna go wild. So Naruto to Boruto Shinobi Striker. Um, yeah, that actually looks like a decent game, but I, that doesn't look like a full-on uh, Naruto game. That's a, that's that's a teaser that's showing a little bit of the combat and just a little bit of the arena fighting. But no, that, that that's that's not. Awesome. <laughs> like, I mean, the Path of the Ninja, the ones I would have played back on the um, 360, were pretty good games. They they actually had a decent kind of like they followed through the plots of the series. It was nice to see some of the cutscenes, some of the events, and actually 3D. We've seen it done again with the as well with the Dragon Ball Budokai series, where it was cool to go like, wow, this is in HD and it was really really pretty and it's that cel shaded look and it looked really awesome. This looks like just an excuse to have four on four combat, which is something that's kind of cool. I like the idea. It's probably one of the best. It's like four on four online um but it definitely feels like a game that's built around the concept of that gundam on gundam next or whatever it was the one that i was playing online there's a video of me playing it for made in japan a while back where you literally had a um, car you had just gundams you're actually in a large arena you're scoring points against each other the whole point is to take over areas uh this looks like just a, a martial art game but with uh four on four teams um i don't know uh, it, it doesn't show much to explain, but I love the fact that the wall runs there, uh, different types of ninjutsu. Um, there's a lot of cool combat going on. It looks like it would be hectic as hell, but that doesn't catch my attention in a lot of ways. Especially because uh, Shippuden doesn't hold my attention as much and the characters are not, the villains aren't as interesting to me. But yeah, Naruto to Boruto, Shinobi Striker. It looks like, a, uh, all right, well, I'm assuming in that case they're going to do multiple kind of like they're going to be able to do multiple levels of characters then because that's going to kind of imply that um, Naruto can actually can make use of the QB's kind of power like that as well. So either that's as a boss or so on, or that they've actually kind of like set up so that you can actually like level up. You're like, you know, we used to be able to like level and then to change forms, change forms, change forms. So you'd probably be able to use it as a special move or as a like limited event or like even if it was actually in one player mode where a couple of your teammates disappear and use someone in. Like one of those instead, same thing matter with different characters. So, um, yeah, Naruto to Boruto, Shinobi Striker. There's a lot to still be seen, but acrobatic ninja battle action looks pretty poor to me. That's a little bit disappointing. 
Well, guys, if you enjoyed watching the, me commented on um, my opinions on this trailer, you can, of course, always hit the um, subscribe button that's way up there in the corner. Or you can, of course, hit anything that's actually over on the side here, uh, videos-wise, to actually see other stuff here on the channel. Or if you want to get a hold of me, you can actually, of course, hit the passage of skin that's right underneath. You can search for that anywhere on any of the streams. So pretty much you just Google it. I'm not hiding anywhere. You can easily find me. So, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I uh, hope to see you guys all in the next trailer. Bye.